hello guys you welcome to this video this video will be guiding us on how to create phantom wallet phantom wallet is not like trust wallet that you can just download from play store it's not like uh, metamask that you get from play store so you download phantom wallet or to create phantom wallet on your mobile device mainly an android device you need an a browser called kiwi browser kiwi browser is just like a browser that uh, that function like google chrome whereby you have an extension you see on google chrome you have extension of uh what you have but on kiwi browser is a mobile function of browser that allows you to get extension so to get phantom account or wallet you need to have it in the form of extension first of all you have to download kiwi browser you can get kiwi browser on google play store on play store you can also get it through google chrome so let's use google chrome let's type kiwi browser kiwi browser so once you tap type in kiwi browser on the search button you see kiwi browser here so if you tap on this link if you tap on the link here you will be taken to google play store where you'll be able to download kiwi browser then you can also get this uh browser on play store all you have to do is to add your play store and type in kiwi browser kiwi So once you tap on Kiwi, once you type in Kiwi browser, Kiwi browser will display here. But because I have downloaded this browser on my phone, go ahead and download this browser on your phone. After downloading it, allow it to install. Then open the browser. Once you open the browser, then we are good to go. What you have to do is first of all, you have to search for. this uh, wallet from Kiwi browser that is phantom wallet phantom wallet so type in phantom wallet there phantom wallet extension you type in phantom wallet extension now phantom wallet extension as been display this is what you need now locate it phantom wallet extension this is it so you tap on that now you see fan try phantom now so you use you select which of these uh, browser that you are using but for the sake of this video we are using google chrome so you tap on chrome tap on chrome this button add extension tap on that button that says add extension when you tap on the button tap on ok so you have to wait a bit for this process to come to complete it won't take uh, longer if you have a very good network but if you're having a slow or poor network, it might take uh, up to a minute or two. But all you have to do is just to wait as you get it done on your phone. Now, it has come up. Tap. Let's start the process now by tapping on create a wallet. If you have an account, for, then you may tap on recovery freeze to recover your account. But because of this process, uh, this video we have to create a phantom wallet all we have to do is to tap on create a uh, wallet now secret recovery freeze this is the only way you can uh, you will be able to recover your account please store elsewhere so all you have to do is to create is to tap on this copy copy that key phrase please please and please again please 
write this key phrase somewhere store it in fact write it and file it with your files now tap on i have saved it somewhere now you have to enter password for the sake of this video i will just put a simple password um one two three four five six seven eight one two three four five six seven seven eight now tap on the agree button that is you agree to the terms and condition of this service now tap on save go ahead and tap on continue button tap on finish now we have successfully uh, created phantom wallet now to open this wallet on kiwi browser locate and tap on the three dots at the top of the screen now scroll up to the base of the page and tap on phantom once tap on phantom you get the dash but this is your phantom wallet guy we have successfully created phantom wallet on our mobile phone using kiwi browser this is phantom because this is a new account there's nothing in this account we've not added money to this account so let's quickly look at some of this uh, menu we can get from this account let's tap on them one after the other let's tap on this one you see once you tap on that your collection this is your collectible everything i mean the coin you have in your phantom will be placed under collectible it's under collectible here you can also swap token here you use this button to swap token on phantom this particular button is used to swap token on phantom you see then you tap on this board to have a view of your recent activities then this is setting you tap on then you come across this one the name of the wallet the language address book then you're able to change your password you change your password then you set auto like uh, auto lock timer then configure network setting in case you want to add some um, coin to your phantom wallet so you do that through change a uh, network then private key show recovery freeze all this is what you get from the setting part of the phantom guy if you enjoyed this video please do subscribe to our youtube channel toggle the bell button to receive notification when we release video like this from our end and don't forget to join our telegram channel as well thanks for watching